What's up guys? So today I'm going to be doing a review on the Pond Hopper box uh, from Mystery Tackle Box or uh, Catch Company. Um, this is a few, one of their featured boxes. Uh, they change up, uh, I guess, every month. So I decided to get the Pond Hopper one. Uh, one, because I liked some of the baits they had in there and uh, could use some of those baits. Um, so I picked this one. All right, so first in the box, we have the live target frog. I'm gonna pull this one out. So I think this frog is gonna be pretty good. I like I like uh, how live target they have that you know that real fine detail. Um, so I think this, this one's going to be pretty good. I mean, granted the fish, all they see is they're going to see just the shadow from underneath, uh, most of the time, you know, but, um, not too bad. Hooks are sharp, so good to go. Not bad. All right. Next in the box. We have a red eye shad from Strike King, uh, lipless crank. I do not have a lot of lipless crank baits, so this, this is one of the reasons why I chose this box. Looks like a sexy shad color. It's got some rattles in there. Looks pretty good. Sharp treble hooks. Good to go. The red eye shed. Alright. Next up, we have a spinner from Strike Back or Mega Strike. Uh, the Strike Back spinner bait. Um, it says here it's got a swiveling action. So let's find out what that does. If I can get it out of the box. There we go. All right, so that hook, uh, back end looks like it, it swivels. Probably to, you know, the good thing about this, um, a lot of times with spinner baits, bass tend to, you know, throw the hook more often. So this might, this is supposed to help keep the fish on. Only thing I don't like is not having a trailer hook in the back, which I might end up throwing one on there. So. Got a willow blade, got a little red paint on halfway down it, and then we got a Colorado blade here. So, this is more for shininess and this is more for vibration in the water. Not bad, not bad. Next up, we have a bag of biospawn. I got a couple of biospawn uh, plastics. Um, so far, I like them. Not bad. Uh, this one's the Eco Stick. This is here. Texas Rig, Wacky Rig, Wacky Jig, Shaky Head. I might even I might throw this on a Shaky Head. Carolina Rig and Drop Shot. Let's open it up. Nope. So as you can tell, half of it is kind of has a like a purple watermelon color and the other half uh, like a pumpkin green it's got a center already on it you can look at my hands they're all greasy already so looks pretty good though throw it on your shaky head and keep it at the bottom we'll try that out this weekend So Biospawn, I have I never heard of them before until I started doing the Mystery Tackle Boxes. And uh, like I said, it's you know the Mystery Tackle Box is meant for you to kind of explore out of your uh, boundaries and kind of try some new baits. So uh, I never even knew this company existed. So not bad. Definitely give those a try. And last, we got some wacky drop shot. Looks like there's six in this package. Okay. Can get it open. 
soapy. My hands are all greased up from that bile spa and exo stick. There we go. Let's take one out here. This is by Skinny Bear. Looks like a one aught. Pretty sharp. So good for drop shotting or wacky rigs. Let's go over some of these baits and what they're worth. So that hollow body frog from Life Target was eleven ninety nine. Um, probably the most expensive frog I own. Uh, the spinner bait is eight ninety nine. The red eye shad is six thirty nine. The that was from Strike King. The exo stick bio spawn. Uh, 599 and then the wacky drop shot hooks are 329 so uh, you don't have to be a member of mystery tackle box to get these um, you don't have to have you know an active s s subscription I think you might have to create an account and you can order these so um, they got a couple other ones on there like I said I'm gonna get the uh, finesse box which is already on its way uh, I need more finesse stuff in my uh, in my arsenal so decided to go with that and uh, yeah, I'll do the review on the finesse box as soon as it gets here. So thanks for watching. Take care and uh, get out and fish.